hi my loves honestly i have so much to say i don't even know where to start but let's start with hi my loves welcome to a new vlog welcome to my maintenance vlog slash law school prep let's just put it on that i don't know what exactly is going to be before we start this video okay i'm putting me here because like i'm dealing with something at the moment but before this vlog is over i'm going to testify i'm just putting it here i'm putting it out there speaking this into the universe so that when i'm testifying at the end of this vlog i would take this part and just remind you guys that i said it because your girl your girl is holding it down babes like i'm just trusting god like i think i'm just at a point in my life where i'm just trusting god fully because honestly at this point i've trusted my man has filled me so put all my faith in god and i'm just waiting on that but welcome to my maintenance vlog my loves um we are you guys already know the drapes we're doing hair nails lashes waxing in this vlog last month we had um drama painting and then we had like my brows but we're not doing that this month i don't do that often but anyways today we're starting with my hair because one thing that's gonna put me in a good mood is a good ass so in honestly i was rotting and i was just like shema yeah you're awesome you've left it to god so like why are you still rotting and crying see i'm going to give you guys the tea okay and by god's grace everything is going to work out like what god cannot do does not exist okay but anyways we're going to get my head on today i'm getting it sewing let me show you guys my bundles i ordered it so in my last vlog i was telling you guys how i was going to order bundles but i was going to that is my guy I work with like a brand the brand i reached out to the offer they gave me i just felt like it didn't pay me don't get me wrong like they all explained to me that it's a small brand and that's the best they could do but still i just didn't feel like it paid me because when you're working like with a brand you have to think long term like your video is going to be there forever i just felt like you know what i have my guy let me just like buy it so yeah i just reached out bum guys I know a lot of you are going to ask for his details. Unfortunately, I will not be sharing his details. Not because I'm gatekeeping, I promise you, okay? But the thing is, he doesn't have an Instagram page. His store is in Lagos Island, by the way. Like, you guys know Lagos Island is like where hair and everything is. That's where it's at, guys. Don't sleep on Lagos Island. Okay, first things first, I got Bob bundles, 12 inches and 10 inches, guys. You know the smell of raw hair. Ah, new hair. Anyways, this is what it looks like. It's absolutely stunning. I just really hope my hairdresser gets it right. I want like bob like that gets hair because you guys know i'm literally in my bob era but i think i should have gotten 12 and 8 but let's see shall because this 10 by the time they put that back like it's going to be too long so they will end up cutting like a lot do you get bob let's just see depends on how the guy does it but yeah um, yeah back to what i was saying if i share his contact i just don't want to be doing any third party this thing um, like i really wish i could share because he's so affordable and he's so good but i just don't want to be in the middle of anything because definitely if someone recommends something to you your is your first instinct will be oh let me go and reach out to this person that her guy is disappointing and honestly i just i just don't have friends but lagos island guys is where it's at and yeah this is what we have let's go and get my hair done when we are done we'll probably wax because your girl needs to wax it's time <laughs> it's time i'm obsessed with this hair oh my goodness my straightener broke let's not even talk about that i will talk about that later but let's go to the salon now good morning and welcome to a new vlog no this isn't a new vlog because i actually recorded something like two days ago getting my head on and then i spoke to you guys but i don't know if i'll add that but i'll probably add that but if this is your first time here hi my name is chioma thank you for tuning in first thing says guys see my eyes like oh my goodness my eyes are so freaking swollen oh but anyways i'm about to get into it with you guys but yeah this is probably this was supposed to be february maintenance but it'll probably be Ferry maintenance and prep with me for law school. I, I wasn't actually going to film this video. I'm just like grateful for strength because, bruh, it's been a tough few days to say the least. You can literally see I look like how I feel. But anyways, post today is Friday. Posting came out Saturday. All my mates have gone to law school. They've registered. They've settled in. But I'm still at home. So posting came out and like obviously you guys know I've been talking to you guys about this thing now. Like the whole thing has been making me anxious because I wanted Lagos. Like I wanted Lagos. Not necessarily because of anything. Various factors. Obviously my content. Like there's just lots of things that I considered. I just prefer to just stay here. I don't really like traveling and it's like having to move to another city it's just, just like but unfortunately i didn't get posted to lagos tried every single thing i can but like just didn't work and yeah i'm here i haven't really i think i'm numb now because i've cried my eyes out like i've just been so stressed and so tired so i'm just numb and i'd rather be numb than actually crying jigger so that's a win is a win 
yeah and obviously don't get me wrong i obviously knew that with this year i was going to have to take a step back with content like i remember even telling you guys in the video that i was going to be posting more pictures on instagram so in my mind i was like whenever i get to like go out with like friends or anything because it's a via like i would just take pictures i didn't even plan to like be recording anything like i was just like just all the strength i have let me just put it with law school and then obviously i was still i felt like i would still be able to show up with like you know events even if it's just one in ten events like obviously like you can't tell me you'll be reading your books like 24 7 every every day you get sometimes you need to like unwind but that's not the point of this i already kind of like planned it like obviously with instagram i wouldn't show up as more just post pictures then with tiktok you know with tiktok you don't necessarily have to plan it because it's not like your videos are monetized you just have to show up to kind of grow your platform and with tiktok you could do vlogs voiceovers all of that there are different options so i already kind of had it mapped down and obviously with youtube i was going to have like lost food diaries and all of that now i've gotten posted to a state that i cannot even like accept because it's like my brain is still i feel like i'm still like short and all of that but yeah that's where i am with life right now i spent the better half of this week just staring at the ceiling and crying but i'm just done crying i feel like i'm just numb like i spoke to someone yesterday though he was okay i don't think i've ever spoken about him he was in my uni he went to law school last year and like he was just like talking to me that chuma please that's you shouldn't like feel bad like obviously i know that i shouldn't like feel bad he was just telling me that obviously everybody will tell me it's just a yeah it's just a i know it's just a yeah okay but it doesn't take away the disappointment do you feel me but yeah that's why i am now i don't want to come on here and talk to you guys because honestly one thing about me i don't like people pity me like even people close to me like my friends and everything i hate when people pity me because for you to pity me it must mean that i'm in a very terrible situation and you just you pitying me is just a reminder that okay i'm in this situation i don't like people pitying me i don't like and it's like i'm at a point right now where people around me can't they don't even know what to say because it's just like, obviously sorry <laughs> like i just don't need any pity like i don't need any pity because the more you pity me the more i just feel bad and i've cried you get it guys see my face <gasps> i haven't even like touched up my hair since i made it on i probably got my head on like three four days ago i haven't touched up to top it off my straightener now broke ah god i said god do you know that one i didn't even let it get to me immediately broke i just ordered a new one because i was like if i don't order this one i will keep staring at this broken straightener and i will be sad so i was like you know what now nah, i'm not even going to let this one get to me like i just immediately think broke i just fell on the floor a perfectly working straightener nothing happened to it i was trying to close this drawer here and the thing opened and it was just very i just ordered a new one the new one is here i don't even think i'm taking it i'm done I don't think i'm taking it with me honestly because i don't want like anything where i get in there like straighteners are not allowed so i'm going to take one of my old straighteners but i just wanted to order this one because you guys know with the way things are in this lagos now the price of things are just going up i went to buy skincare yesterday and then i went to do like my lab reports and all of that yesterday yeah skincare is skincare now the prices of skincare i'm just like my skin i better act right like i need to be able to use nivea to cream my face and not care like my body cream on my face i just and <sighs> anyways that's where i am right now guys so i don't know i honestly do not think we're going to have a lot of school vlogs the thing is my friend has told me not to cancel the state here that i should get there and see how it is but guys i just found out that it's five in a room oh my god like it's like when i feel like it can't get any worse i'm just being so deeper and deeper because it's like <gasps> god can can i breathe can i leave and that's the main reason why i actually wanted lagos because like with lagos you can pay for your room not because of anything it's not like i'll be filming there because it's not like the rooms are like fancy fancy i just wanted to have my space can you guys see my eyes like they're actually so swollen jesus christ and i've lost so much weight people haven't seen me I'm like you've lost weight i'm like okay just leave me you don't have to say it it's like please guys stop commenting on people's weights like you don't know what they're going through okay but yeah that's it i like my hair though but i haven't really been able to like enjoy it because i've just been really sad and yeah i feel like when i take this off i'm going to go bald but yeah i don't know i just feel like i'm at a point where i just want to do something really drastic i feel like that will make me feel way better but yeah anyways apparently we're going to be there for three months come back for externship then go back to just finish up and write exam but yeah let's move on from that even if i've been rambling for time today i'm going back to the lab to get my to drop my final sample and then get my results everything actually all of that then i feel like we're going to pack i wanted to leave monday plan to leave monday even if monday is when classes are starting i'm just like okay like i can't die like you didn't give me time to process and grieve like can't die like okay get there and register i need to book my flights this weekend okay guys i'm currently at the lab i need to pick up my test results and drop one more sample wait for them to run that and then i would head out to my doctor 
honestly where do i miss that so my way tell me why one last one guy literally entered my car i told me to give me a ride it was funny shot nothing but um yeah i don't know if you guys remember this shit like i showed you guys in my morning routine vlog i haven't even edited that i haven't posted that because i've been in a funk but yeah everything literally went so now i'm able to wear it so i'm just wearing it for my appointment now guys i was just staring at my hair and i'm like child my hair is actually a mess <laughs> my hair is actually a mess the thing is i forgot to wash my bundles you know when you buy your hair for the first time you're supposed to wash it to get that smell you know that new bundle smell like out of it like i forgot to do that because i was just not myself it was like when the guy was done with my hair and i went home and i was smelling my hair i was like i actually forgot to wash you like and i think it cost acne so i've honestly just been packing my hair and i'm not ready to style it till i actually wash it then i'll now you see my hair in full action like the bobbing i have plenty of styles in my head and then that reason why i decided to get a long bob was so i could also pack it like this when i'm not in the mood because obviously you know with school like you're not obviously going to have your hair down every time it's not giving fashion parade it's giving go and read your books mm, but yeah let's go and pick my test results <sighs> do my eyes still look swollen oh my goodness this one still looks so swollen i don't want anybody to ask me if i'm okay guys i'm telling you that oh this is well like i actually just forgot that there are actually other people in my shoes <laughs> someone just texted me now how we're talking she also got posted to that stage she was like chuma i'm dreaming <laughs> guys i haven't been able to sleep i'm not even joking like i'll literally wake up in the middle of the night and like logging to see if anything has changed because guys what god can do doesn't exist like god is going to use me <laughs> to perform this miracle you know when they say chime miracle that's what god is going to give me i don't want to lose hope like i don't want to lose hope <laughs> Bro, like, I've just been, I'm literally on the floor in my room. I don't have sheets on my bed. Like, I've just been lying on the floor. Like, I even slept on the floor two days ago. Bed floor. Staring at the ceiling. When I'm done crying, I'll sleep. <laughs> and I know some of you, I'll be like, Chima, like, it's not that deep. Baby, it's that deep. Like, it's deep. Like, if you wear my shoes, you will get. <laughs> anyway, so on my way back, I stopped at the first house get shot my god it was trash like i don't know what's happening today like when i'm trying to do farewell eating like everything is trash it wasn't nice then i just stayed in the car for a bit like when i got home i just couldn't like get myself to come upstairs like i was just like in the car just staring i just said well let me come upstairs at least if i stay on the floor my room is better <laughs> then what else happened oh my goodness guys i got an email there's an event next week wednesday so they started sending out emails i mean events have started coming for the year and i'm just like god is this what you want to do to me <laughs> like and the event is wednesday by 7 pm so if i like my gosh grace i don't know i don't know i don't know guys on my way back like when i was trying to get to shawarma like when i was at that area like one guy came to meet me and then he was like oh like i'm really pretty blah blah you get then he was like oh he wants my normal i'm like see let me not lie to you i will not respond to your message like i have a lot on my mind right now <laughs> like in my mind i'm just like if only you know what's doing me you know that he's not me giving you my number like he not said don't worry me to have a lot on my mind I said no i'm serious like i actually can't give my number like i would not respond to you <laughs> like i just said let me be real with you like i actually don't have time because it's like you know almost like, it's my like when you say oh no they'll think it's like maybe you just try telling them you know keep chasing like no i just don't want like everybody just leave me alone i want to try and film like a video waxing and then what's the other one my nails so i can at least post like february maintenance on instagram but i just do not have the will i don't have the strength the thing is the portal is down now so i haven't even like logged in to like check anything again ah guys there's nothing god cannot do see if god should listen for me honestly i will actually just testify like because it's not a small miracle hello my loves good morning i don't know is it dark i already like unplugged my vanity and everything because i felt i wasn't going to vlog you know what let me just turn it on okay yeah this is way better how are you guys doing good morning today is hair day so i finally washed my bundles <laughs> oh my goodness see how i look so weird i finally washed my bundles honestly guys i cannot believe that i forgot to wash my bundles before not like i even forgot i just didn't care i can't believe i could actually like put that thing on my head i felt like it was just smelling like i just didn't like it and funny how when i got the bundles like i smelled it i was like chima don't forget to wash this thing before installing it didn't do that put it on my head i was like i'm smelling this thing while i'm sleeping i'm just like that's nasty so i just washed it this morning and the hair is like nice so time to like blow dry and style it Oof, this is this is cute the hair is so good and honestly one thing i've also learned like while buying her from this guy his length is longer than what you see on instagram if i had known the exact length i probably wouldn't have gotten 10 until i probably would have gotten 12 and 8 i don't know how to explain because like his hair is longer i'm chatting jigger but anyways you guys i woke up this morning and 
I was just really down. My spirits was just so low. Like I had to pinch myself. I was like, is this a dream? But I was like, Chema, it's not a dream. Like <laughs> you're awake. This is your life now, okay? But yeah, so I'm just here chilling, just taking it slow. I'm going to pack today. I didn't even end up going for the wedding because guys, I feel like I can just be there start crying. Because I have a lot to do. I'm trying to pack, I'm trying to shop. I feel like I want to book my flight for Monday. I still feel like there's nothing God cannot do. I already like unplugged everything around my vanity, like the extension, everything. So I can plug my blue dryer. So I'm literally by my bed trying to use the extension, this thing here. <sighs> do you know what I'm really grateful for my platform, like my social media and everything, especially my YouTube. It's like prior to me like picking up my camera to vlog, because obviously I didn't even plan to vlog again, like I was just too sad. I wasn't even speaking, like I wasn't speaking to anybody in my house. Like I would I locked myself in my room for like a whole week just crying, like just go downstairs to like take water or just something you get but like since i picked up my camera like i've kind of gotten myself back and that's just why it's like really sad because just like when i go to work like i don't even know if i'll be able to vlog like i can't be vlogging with five people in my room like do you get what i'm trying to say it's just not the vibe let's let me see would this thing during the because the water is low okay it's not big thing. Guys, please tell me why this month actually died. <laughs> the solar hasn't kicked in yet. <laughs> Bro, like, can my life keep... Like, can it get any worse? Like, cool. Guys, I just literally turned on the gen. Like, I just couldn't be asked. Honestly, I would have said, like, okay, you know what? Let me wait till they bring light. Where is the hairbrush I was just using? I would have said, let me wait till they bring light. But I have a lot of things to do today. I'm trying to park. I'm trying to shop. Do you know the funny thing? I can't even buy a lot of things because of excess luggage. Like... This, this is my life. This was actually why I wanted to stay here because it's like, now I have to be stressing like, what do they have there? Where is my hairbrush? Hold on. I'm back. So basically, I have to like be stressing like, what do they have there? Like, what would I put in my box that would consider like the whole thing excess luggage? And it's like, I don't even know. Like, I don't even know. Okay. This is what my hair is looking like. She's so full. Like, I love her. She is stunning. This is even like a look. Anyways, I'm going in with my mega growth leave in conditioner. <sighs> Someone else just found out that I got posted where I got posted. So the person is like, wow. <laughs> because honestly, there's nothing else to say. It's just wow. You know, like people are just calling to like check in and like, how far away you? I just I can't do that right now, okay? Anyways, don't forget to like condition your weaves and like you know take care of your hair. Like these are your babies. So when my hair is like almost dry, like damp-ish, I go in with my leave-in conditioner. But I'm thinking of getting like those spray-on leave-in conditioners next, or maybe I'll just be mixing this one in a spray bottle. I don't know, but I really like this leave-in conditioner though. Like, oh, what's mega growth? Like popular one. It's literally so affordable and it gets the job done. Okay, guys. So I'm done. When I was done blow drying, I went into straighten and bob my hair. One thing they do not tell you though, long bobs are high maintenance. Like. I mean probably already knew that but i'm not gonna lie like i mean it looks really nice and this is not even my best work i didn't have like my mirror placed properly in front of me <sighs> another thing i forgot to do was dye my natural hair i wanted to dye my hair black not like jet black i wanted to dye my hair black before getting my bonus because my hair is brown i don't know if you can see from there like my hair is brown so it doesn't like blending blending i always have to like going extra extra i don't know i don't know but yeah it looks okay she's stunning i what i even did is better than what that guy did when i actually got the head on i told you nobody does it like me on me but it was really hard shot because obviously bob in the back i even need to like trim the back because the back is really long i'm talking too much i'm trying to wax i had to change my shirt because i'm trying to get some clips for instagram short form content this might be the only video i would be able to post this month my february maintenance routine i mean the january one did really really well so i'm just like hopefully the same thing happens this month like i always tell you guys i make my wax myself but funny how i don't know how this is going to work because this is the wax i used the last time i saw this in the fridge i even forgot i just remembered so i just added more sugar because i don't know and then i heated it so i don't know is it gonna work let's try it i mean there's no harm in trying 
hopefully it works i mean it's applying really well huh guys wish me luck i really hope it works okay let me shut my trap before this thing actually stains my what stains applies on my hair Oof. so moving on to the fabric i'm just going to place my fabric now let's see i feel like it would work sharp <sighs> i haven't waxed in a minute i'm not even gonna lie to you i haven't waxed in a minute so this feels like new to me again guys you know i was thinking today like should i bother waxing because like going to where i'm going now i wouldn't be able to make my wax but i'm thinking of ordering there's this wax thing i saw on aliexpress guys i'm literally staring at myself because i feel so pretty with this hair but that's besides the point I, I saw this wax thing on aliexpress that the normal wax that people use abroad like they heat it up and then they roll it i'm thinking of buying that because last time i checked it was really pricey and it's price of dollar now hmm that would be a really big investment too but let's see how it goes because i don't want to make and take it because i want it to heat it up like i don't know i just want the one that i would rather plug i don't know if they sell that in lagos here do you think they sell it? please if you know where they sell it let me know well at least if they sell it in lagos i could just order it where um but i haven't really seen it anywhere i'm talking too much let me rip this thing okay one two ready okay let me finish up with this and then i'll be back because guys this thing is so painful i can't even concentrate guys this is my second strip for this bit i'm filming it on here so yeah Honestly, I felt like I needed to feel this pain, this waxing pain. Like, it's not even a lot right now. Like, normally whenever I'm waxing, I'll be like, <gasps> like, the pain is just there. Like, I really needed to feel this pain. Like, I don't even know if that makes sense. That's probably a weird thing to see, but I just need to feel physical pain. Do you get so that, like, the emotional pain will just reduce. So I really needed this. <laughs> well, I'm going to miss waxing. I'm actually going to miss waxing, I'm not going to lie. But yeah. Guys, I'm done. I'm so happy that I waxed today. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. I'm so happy. So now I want to tidy up, then have my bath, then come and fix my nails. We're going really short with the nails and we're going nude because obviously we're not about to pop up with like red. Like extremely short. Like even right now, my nails are like so short. I can't even show you guys. Like I just cut them with like nail cutter when I was like in my frenzy. But yeah let's move on do you know my camera is low but i've already packed my charger so i have to go and get started like pack every single thing but i was like i have to show up for you guys so that's what i'm doing showing up for my youtube fan i don't even care for like my other people <laughs> actually i do care but like youtube is just if for me like i have to show up for you guys regardless anyways talk to you guys when i'm done let me tidy up because ants and wax five and six okay so i literally just had my bath my skin is literally so dry this weather is not even helping but i want to film like a mini skin reset so we're going to get into that in a bit this scarf i tried to do the whole you know when you get a silk press done there's this thing on tiktok that you wrap your hair in a certain way i tried that but i don't think i got it i'm too scared to take the scarf off i want to show you guys the skincare product i got recently so i went to buy better i got this simple moisturizer um i got this kosara x advanced snail machine my girl then i decided to get this simple face wash because my panoxyl obviously i use that in the morning and i don't think you're meant to be using it in the morning evening every single day you're not meant to do that so before i was using dope bar soap but i just felt like dope bar soap the maintenance will not be really great when i go for law school like obviously i'll have to put in a soap dish I just don't have time for that then i got this threads knowing gel i think my skin is that whole purging thing now shall we change our environment and all of that so i'm just like really really scared let me take this out because i'm about to use it this like cosara x what's with this packaging Oop, why is it so tight okay i think i just need to tear it because what is this <laughs> oh okay so let me start using this i also needed to get um oh this is nice i needed to get um b3 sauce they didn't have i screamed when i got there i was like you do not have like why okay let's take this card down Ooh. okay you're meant to like roll it roll it Ooh. did i get it right why is my hair flying here let's see mm, okay okay it might actually not be bad though 
okay she's actually not looking too bad honestly my hair itself it needs to blend better with this so in i don't know the color is just not coloring maybe i will just dye this part too like i'm not even joking like if i get angry like when i get to like wherever i'm going like i would dye my leave out because i can't deal with this color match thingy like, my hair keeps getting browner every single day anyways okay this is nice we can work with this for now oh doesn't look bad but you know i didn't sleep with it so i can't really see if i scuffed it well or not i just had my bath so let's move on to like the whole skincare thing let me get my phone so i can film it good afternoon or is it morning today is wednesday i think last time i spoke to you it was probably saturday or sunday I'm not even sure maybe even friday but i haven't vlogged the next week i'm leaving for law school tomorrow finally finally wrap my head around everything i feel like i'm just at a point where it's like i just don't care anymore like i'm not the girl that's just going to stay crying like i'm not crying but don't get me wrong i'm not happy i just don't care do you get me i just don't care so i'm currently packing i'll take you guys some of the pieces that i'm taking with me so i have this really cute blazer i've had it for a minute i have never styled it like i just thought that it was just not giving my vibe but it'll be so cute for law school so it's like it, is it this blazer or jacket i don't know honestly but you get and he has this thing here this is the only detail on it i ordered dresses from one instagram vendor so let me show you guys the dresses that came in this dress she is so stunning i love the pe what's this what's rouge detail here on the sleeve and then it's like basic it has like a slit at the back the dresses are actually really nice i didn't have faith in the dresses though i'm not gonna lie then i have this other black dress i love this thingy by the side she's so cute and the dresses were so affordable then i have this i love this i really like the dresses they just have like all their little details on them then this is last one yeah this one it has this thingy here guys they're absolutely cute i mean at least i wouldn't look like how i feel you know <laughs> guys my sheets are literally dry like the sheets and like pillowcases and the cover to everything dry so let's see thank you time because i couldn't continue packing till they finished it's literally like 3 p.m actually so dried in busy like two hours and it was like dripping wet so that is great so we're going to start with my sheets down here guys i don't know if i already mentioned but i can only take a box that weighs 15 kg i don't know if i already mentioned that but if i haven't like that is crazy because i feel like by the time i add my shades and my black and white like it's already 15 kg what's left i don't know but i feel like i'll have to wave you the rest of my things but i don't think i have too many things honestly because i'm not taking anything like i'm just not in the mood like i'm over it i have a pr package coming today hopefully it comes today before i leave after today i can't accept any pr only if okay i can accept actually joe but it's just like who will receive it maybe they'll drop it on my gates then someone will pick it when they're coming in <sighs> anyways let me just finish packing because i don't even know see this thing has already taken all this oh god but i see if you're trying to go to law school do anything to get it because i'm not even joking because this is not the life i signed up for like when did i start packing to leave lagos and they're telling me 15 kg box like me that i like to pack load please i'm not even in the mood again <laughs> I'm still not done packing and it's 6 p.m but i'm done sorting everything like hair things are here i had to call somebody to find out the things that are actually not allowed so i don't waste my time packing it just sharp objects kettles and i didn't even have those things in the first place i just wanted to confirm if i could take my straightener my blue dryer and all of that so <clears throat> over here i have my hair things i had to even like pack hold on where's my gel so this was the gel i was initially going to take large size but i was just like it made no sense because i had this and it was empty so i just put it here so can you see can you see the things i have to do to my what's the word 
my smile space i don't know if that's english but you guys get me so now the thing is i have the way told me that i shouldn't like bring a lot of those things obviously like so they don't think that i'm coming to come and do hairdresser work or something but what i have right now i have this blow dryer honestly guys the gifting what's the word gifting of things in events a lot of this i think they've actually stepped up because tell me why this blow dryer actually came from i think a wedding or a birthday party i'm not sure and when i got here i was like what could i use this thing for let me just keep it now it actually makes sense i'm taking it with me i'm not taking like my big blow dryer but anyways that's all i have for now let me just finish packing then i'll talk to you guys when i'm done i don't know where to start from like god i can't do this like ugh. guys can probably not see me because lighting is bad i'm outside it's like dark i just say uh, take a walk but yeah the last time i spoke to you i was at home packing and then i finished packing went to bed really late then i hopped on my flight this morning and i got here today oh my earring just fell <laughs> so i decided to end this vlog now um <clears throat> your girl is having the worst time of her life just really praying it gets better but yeah this is the end of the vlog i'm definitely not going to put out this vlog till life changes for me whenever i decide to put it out even when i'm in a better place sure, that's when i'll put it out but thank you guys so much for watching and thank you so much for supporting my content both on like instagram tiktok youtube i don't know what's going to happen after this i don't know what like probably won't be vlogging I hope you guys stick by and you know are ready to welcome me with open arms when I decide to come back. I won't decide because it's never like a decision I'm making, like something I have to do. You get me? But yeah, that's it. Your girl has been crying. <laughs> What's new? But yeah, that's it. I will see you guys in my next vlog. I honestly can't talk too much because I don't even think you can hear me. But yeah, please subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and I will see you in my next one hi guys so today is today's friday the whole week here okay actually not a week yet but like a few days but the end of the week how am i feeling i don't know i'm definitely not vlogging anything but i just would like to document things on my phone you get just like look back hopefully something changes really soon to look back and you know feel more grateful about everything can you guys literally see me like, i look like what i'm going through I'm even asking myself why I bother to bring my camera because it's like it has been in my bag. I'm even so scared of like taking it up and down because I'm like, I don't know. But yeah, this is me. How my life can literally just change. Like, it's just crazy. Oh, I'm just tired of crying. You know when you're just so tired of crying and like you can't even cry again. You can't even cry. I can't even cry again because like i'm just so tired of crying i finally posted on instagram today because like i had this video my february maintenance video i've had it on my phone since i won't let it go so like, before for time i finally got the strength to like edit it and then i put it out today because like obviously people are going to like damn where have you been that's what i wasn't ready for and like replying comments but i had this PR that i wanted to post on my story so i was just like you know let me just use the opportunity to post the february maintenance video the january one did really well so hopefully this one does well and it's able to take me through a month because i think i only have two videos that i can even post so i have to kind of like drag it i don't know if dragging this is the word but honestly guys i'm just so sad <laughs> but i'm just documenting this i'm going to post this when i'm in a much better place but i just know that i just know that bad things don't last forever if that makes sense so i'm just trying to give myself that I'm just trying to hold on to that i feel like i'll be checking with you guys like once a week to let you guys know how i'm feeling so today like on a scale of one to ten I pro i'm probably at, like in minus five i'm not even joking you see my hair there's literally no light to bob my hair i don't even know why i did this sewing i feel like when i take out this sewing i'm going to cut my hair no cut and just be pouring water on my head like i'm just so fed up i'm so sad like i'm so 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 sad i don't even think you guys get sick like i'm so so sad <sighs> i'll talk to you guys later bye <laughs>